Hello, Marlene here with yet another short anti horror game Mitch. This one called a laundry night, where we take a late night trip to the laundromat to do our laundry. It's incredibly peaceful when no one else is around, and we don't have to wait for a washer to be available. But out of nowhere, spooky things start to happen. Will we survive the night? <laughs> I don't know. Let's find out. Let's do our laundry. Oh, this looks pretty good. Why does it sound so creepy already? I love doing my laundry this time of night. It's always so peaceful when no one else is around. That's honestly relatable. Do we drive a Volvo? Cute. Uh, first I need to grab a basket of dirty laundry and put it in the washing machine. Is this our basket? Does it matter what basket? Okay. Uh, any washer? <laughs> so immersive. Yeah, put it in. Next, add detergents. <laughs> Laundry simulator, I am in. Finally, add the quarters. Okay. Should we close it first? Yeah, there we go. And quarters. Yeah. Oh, this music's actually pretty good. It's not creepy at all. It's relaxing. Oh, change. Yeah. <laughs> Some fine looking realistic quarters right there. Now, yeah, pop those in. And then we wait. 10.53 at night. I actually kind of miss going to the laundromat to do my laundry. Out of order. It was a good excuse to sit around and do nothing. Right, let's check out this bulletin board. Ooh, missing $5,000 reward. A free personality test. Oh, fun. Oh, wow, time is flying by in this laundry mat. Can we go outside? Oh, we can. Nice. I can drop my laundry off in the car when it's done. Noted. Ooh, how far can we go? Oh, I feel an invisible wall coming on. Maybe? Oh, I don't know. I feel like I have so much freedom in this game. Oh, it's cars. Look at this. The city is so alive. Can we cross the road too and everything? Oh no, there it is. I knew it had to be somewhere. I knew our freedom here was too good to be true. Oh my god, we can't go into this parking lot. Oh, this is amazing. Ooh, can we go back here? Next, I move the wet clothes to the dryer and add some quarters. Yeah. Give me a minute. Also, you don't use dryer sheets? <laughs> what are you thinking? They make your clothes smell so nice and fresh. Uh, this sign is backwards. <laughs> but still, it's nice to be able to see it. I guess we'll go put our clothes in the dryer then. Ooh, what's over here? Oh, can we get in there? So much to explore. <laughs> Locked, okay. I guess not. All right. Back to the task at hand. Yeah, close this. Grab our laundry. Ooh, that was noisy. Basket? Okay, and then laundry. Alright. I assume any will do. It's all sparkly too. That's when you know it's clean. Put the quarters in. Put the quarters in. Do we need to get more quarters? Okay. Oh, lovely. How can this game get scary? This is very peaceful. Yeah, definitely close that. Wouldn't want someone tripping on it. Oh, hang on. The radio is doing something. It's going staticky. Are these my laundry too? Wait, how many freaking loads are we doing here? Oh, maybe not. Yeah, this laundry is not ours. We're ready for something creepy to happen. Hopefully we didn't miss it while we were out gallivanting on the town. <laughs> Testing our barriers. As you do. <laughs> Finally, drop off the clothes in my car. You're very excited about that protagonist. Not that I blame you. Why is it smoking? Yeah, pop that in there. Can we just leave? I can drop my laundry off in the car when it's done. I did that, yeah? Oh, so we are doing multiple loads. Just one at a time, really? Oh, you just have to use different washer machines. Oh my god. And we can do them all at the same time. Jesus. Okay, well. Close, close. Get some quarters. One going. Okay, here we go. We'll be done soon. Is that it? Yeah, these are empty. Okay. Now we wait again. I apologize for wasting so much damn time not realizing we had three damn baskets of laundry. That is a lot of laundry. Oh, it's finally ready. Sorry, I was reading. I was just getting immersed. Alright, let's move these bad boys to the dryer. Let's make sure you use different dryers. <laughs> that, that, perfect. Close and close. 
change. I mean, I'm getting good at this. It's like I've done this before. <laughs> yeah, let's close these up. Let's look around again. Let's find a, <laughs> a scary moment in this game. Something scary's gotta happen, right? Or am I just completely missing it all? Too immersed in my book, I guess. Oh, it's almost 11 o'clock. Construction job fair. Sound effects are quite good. Okay, last loads are finished. That one. Pop it in the car. And last load. <gasps> that just slammed on its own. Okay, let's just get it. Get out of here. Prepare yourselves for something spooky. It's, it's locked. What is that strange noise? The radio? <gasps> Are we okay? <laughs> Try the door again. Locked. Can we turn this off? Uh... Are we okay? <laughs> what? How are we supposed to get out of here? It's not even 11 o'clock yet somehow. Let me out! Can we put this down? What do I do? What do we do? Okay, they said something about a noise, so... Oh, I don't need more change. Yeah, drop that. Neat pile of change. <laughs> are we going to die in here? I don't want to die doing laundry. That sounds horrible. <laughs> what do you do? I don't know what's, what I'm supposed to do. Let's try to buy a drink with the change, yeah? Oh, it works. Nice. Oh, we got some flaming Hot Cheetos. Nice. Good taste. Mm -mm. Now I regret not trying change on the machine outside. It should definitely be 11 by now. <laughs> definitely been locked in here for longer than a minute. Oh, something's moving on the board. Oh. <gasps> What? Does anyone know this strange woman that is staring at me through the window? Is she homeless or something? Yeah, I saw her too on June 16th. I tried to talk to her, but she disappeared right in front of me. Holy shit. Who is this weird lady? I think she's a ghost. Don't be dramatic, ghost. Not real, you idiot. Uh, do not be alone after midnight. She will come for you. Oh, is it after midnight suddenly? <laughs> what? She's gonna be staring at the window. Okay, now we're good. Did the dryer just open on its own? Oh, something did happen with the other order one. <laughs> Can we close it? I don't ever want to see- it. <gasps> Yeah, let's just keep that close. Can we leave now? I am ready to leave now. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> uh, let's go. Um, are we okay? Oh. Okay. I'll be breaking these windows. Oh, she is in the window! Hi! Oh. Is she like a little girl who got murdered in the laundromat? <gasps> Probably stuffed in a dryer. Oh. Okay, let's try to leave. Let's just go. 12, 12 now, let's go. My cell phone is dead and the fog is too thick to drive home. Are you kidding me? Get in your car anyway. Yeah, I can drop off my laundry. I wonder if there's an old phone in the back. I guess let's go find out where did this fog come from? Did we just get moved dimensions? Uh, looking for a phone, are we? Should have grabbed some change. Uh, we should probably go, oh, we can go in the back. Let's go grab some change, just in case, because we might need it, yeah. And uh, let's see if we can get some soda or something. You know, to wash down those flaming Hot Cheetos. Yeah. Dr. Pepper. Noise. Yeah, grab more change. Okay, let's go look for a phone then. Now that our <laughs> appetite and thirst are finally quenched. Oh! Oh, look at this! Uh, please find me! Oh, hi! Find me, find me! Good voice acting. Dead. I don't think that's the only thing that's dead around here. Hang in there, I'm trying. We got a note. To all employees, please note that until further notice, the dumpster is to be opened by the manager only. Why? Uh, okay. Is that a sign to go to the dumpster? What's going on with the dumpster? Let's go to the dumpster. 
Sounds interesting. Is there a body in there? There's gonna be a body in there. It is saying, please find me. Okay, let's go see if there's a key or something in the office. We have a spirit to put to rest. Pills? Uh, drop those. Okay, we can't pick those up. Or the smokes. Okay, there's gotta be a key somewhere to get into that dumpster. Yep. There we go. I know what I must do. <sighs> I'm coming, little girl. Or lady. Whatever you are. Yeah. There she is. It's a fucking skeleton with a whole shitload of blood underneath it. Damn. <laughs> Honestly, kind of just a sad story. Created by Megan Ginter. Well done. Honestly, that got really good. There was a couple moments in there. Very adequately creepy. Definitely enjoyed it, even though it took me a little too long to figure out I had three loads of laundry to do and to finally do them. And to finally see that note on the uh, bulletin board there. I think I missed some dialogue that might have pointed me in the right direction. But quite the twist at the end, too, in the dumpster. Presumably, the manager of this laundromat murdered a girl. Hopefully they got caught and, you know, I heard the sirens at the end, so presumably we called the proper authorities to figure that out. Either way, that was Laundry Night. As always, let me know what you thought in the comments below, and thank you so much for joining me for this one. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, give it a like. If you want to see more like it, subscribe, and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye!